Well hi there folks, you're probably wondering and why not what all this is about. Well let me tell you, now you may or may not have seen my latest mini little glider build, the build, complete build blog is on my channel. Well I came across a problem once I bought the battery for it. When I bought it it was just like that, it's got this strange little balancing plug on it. So I thought fair enough, well first off I added a JST to it, but the obvious problem is how do you charge it? it quickly became apparent that this particular type of balance plug is smaller than the standard three pin balance plug. So then I figured well presumably you need a special charger for it. The battery was only five pounds, seemed a bit senseless spending another five or ten pounds on just the charger for this one battery. So I came up with the idea, I've got a few of these kind of drone battery chargers or helicopter battery chargers, decided what I'd do was try and modify this one because it's got easy access. I'll show you in a sec. Four, cup, four screws out of there. I can get the board out. What I decided to do was use some dressmaking pins, having checked first that they will actually slide into these little pin holes because they are tiny. I thought if I use three of these I can make an external three pin socket. So where did I start? Well first mark the position of three little holes on the side of the case, heat the pin over the gas and then carefully push through three holes, then I soldered on three short lengths of wire, put some shrink on so that they wouldn't short once inside, and then push them through from the inside, put on a tiny little blob of solder here, sticking out as far as I could, tiny bit of solder here, so that when you push the plug in it didn't put, have a chance of pushing back in, and then using super steel, put plenty of blobs around it, decent blob of super steel on the inside, I have tried taking it apart to show you inside but now it's put together it's not easy to get to get apart. Anyway having soldered having soldered three tiny little wires on the back ends of these, put the circuit board back in, soldered to the back end of the three pins that go to these three pins, marked it up obviously so that I know which is positive and negative and as you can see when I plug it in making sure you do it the right way, negatives on the right, plug it in there and as you can see it works. So for the sake of half an hour's work and a cost of three pins and a bit of super steel I've now actually got a dedicated charge for my micro batteries. Anyway I thought I'd share that with you. I think it's quite a nice solution for charging these little batteries. It does balance well because I've tested. If you haven't seen the build blog for my solo mini little, these are five pounds to buy or they were six pounds in my local model shop quite a challenging build actually. Anyway full details on the build blog for that which I'll link and perhaps you haven't seen my four engine version of that in which I use four drone motors and the transmitter from the drone and it flies really well. I could show you the build blog for that's also online and the maiden's online for that. Still waiting for a maiden for this one. Anyway hope you found that useful, maybe interesting. If you did why not check out some of the other vids? Like I say, there's loads of build blogs with little gliders and all kinds of foam board stuff, paragliding, paramotoring, blah, 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 you name it. If you liked it, give it a like, maybe even subscribe. But that's all for now. Thanks for watching and hopefully I'll catch you all again later. Happy flying.